Should be another prowler stash right here. Maybe I should make some spider stashes around the city. We need a better angle to pull that unit up. More lasers? Hunt's been watching way too many bad spy movies. No way Prowler crawled through those lasers without a plan. Something here has to deactivate that laser field. There you are. out in Hunter's Point, Prowler's first training ground. Wait, really? I had to test out my tech somewhere. Enter soon. at your own risk. How'd you get the hang of your powers? I actually did. Now the fun really starts. <laughs> Gotta find her. Fight for your life, Spider-Man. <laughs> Not see reality. You can only feel it.
Okay, it's all over now. On the other side was a freezer. I was telling me, actually send that to me later. Spider-Man taking a photo of what's coming. It feels like something that. Ha <laughs> The bodega beef. It was already a rivalry for the ages when it was just David versus Goliath. But when Tails had to deal with the bodega copying his success by using the exact same mascot, it stepped up to a whole nother level. We might have to move that somewhere else. Opened up plenty of these before. Don't mind if I do. Hunters. Yes, some of them stay behind after Craven. Got a few unauthorized access attempts for my stash in the shipping yard. Ran into Craven's hunters. You were right about them wanting your tech. They must be real good if they found it. Even your dad wasn't able to. Dad? It was the first showdown between Officer Jefferson Davis and the Prowler. Had to hide in that ship. Been container for hours just to lose him. Well. Most wish he caught me right then and there. Never wanted him to get involved. Well, I'm glad you're out of the game now. Stay safe. Should be able to move that, no problem. Can't hide from me.
Hey, Miles. Got an alert from the stash at my old place. You lived in that penthouse? Back in the early prowler days. Call you back in a... All right. Hey, Miles. What's up? Hey, good to see you. Man, I can't believe Mr. Atlas is gonna be here at BV. Maybe one of those scholarships has my name on it. If he likes my sound. Hey, Miles! Over here! Hey. Whew. You made it. I want to talk to him about that computational physics program. We got your missing person report half an hour ago. What happened? That's just it. We don't know. She left to get something from her car and then never came back. I just heard two words, missing in person. So I'm going to say yes. Go ahead. We'll save your seat. Gotta catch up to the principal. Maybe I could find out more. Hey! If it isn't Morales, the music master. What's up, Delisai? You here to see that university rep, Mr. Atlas? Yeah, definitely. Nice astronomy booth. Thanks. You should stop by later. I made a 3D model of Saturn, but get this. It's cake! I'll save you a slice. Hmm, thanks. I can't leave until I figure out what's going on with the missing person. That person might be lost, confused, or kidnapped. I gotta find out more. Do you have any of her personal items? Yes. She left her phone behind. Is it unlocked? Have you seen any text count? Here we go. Just some notifications from her fitness tracker. It's counting her steps. Wherever she is. The students adore Miss Ferguson. I hope she's all right. Please find her. We'll do our best. Miss Ferguson's missing. Oh, man. Sounds like she's still wearing her fitness tracker. Wonder if I could find that signal. All right. Let's see where this fitness tracker is. Last known location, Dawson Harbor. Beginning text-to-speech call with Haley Cooper. Miles, Mr. Atlas just got here. ETA? Oh, man! Gotta find Miss Ferguson first. Be there when I can. He's handing out scholarship applications right now. Uh, do you get one for me? I'll do better than that. Send you a link. Thanks. Good luck. And hurry. Hey, yo, Miles. What's up, Genki? Can this wait? Not really. I've got Mr. Atlas here. I told him how you were missing the fair for volunteer work, and he asked for a phone call with you. Is uh, now a good time? Thanks, Genki. But now is definitely not a good time. Here he is, Mr. Atlas. I know you've got a flight to catch. Genki! Hi. Miles? Uh, yeah. Hello. You're whispering. Is now a bad time? Uh, no. I'll make it work. That's me. Great. I heard you're interested in our music technology program. So, tell me about yourself. What do you do for fun? Fun? Uh, well, I used to do music production. But 
It's been hard to find time. Genki here showed me some of your samples. Good stuff. Particularly your song called Swinging. What was your inspiration? Uh, yeah. I was, uh, just swinging one day and thinking. Uh, Sorry, kind of came. Gotta go. Um, I'll call you later. Or email. That could have gone better. Maybe I can make it back to BV in time to meet Mr. Atlas in person and clarify some things. All right. Those guys out of the way. Let's see where that tracker signal leads. <laughs> this signal should lead right to Miss Ferguson's fitness tracker. Ferguson, I'd better follow that signal. Pretty breakable. I got you. Are you okay? I'm fine. But who are these people? How do they know I work for Rand? Let's figure that out when we're not in the hostage situation. You hide. I've got these guys. By yourself? It's in my job description. <sighs> Ready to go? Are you going to carry me? Sure. I've carried people before. As long as I can get verbal confirmation that if I throw up on you, you won't sue me. <sighs> Consider this confirmation. Just try to tell a brother first.
<sighs> Thanks to Spider-Man, our treasured teacher, Miss Ferguson, is back with us safe and sound. To show our gratitude, it is my honor to declare Spider-Man the official hero of Brooklyn Visions. You are always welcome here, Spider-Man. Thank you. And now, back to the quad. We've got a robotics demonstration to do. Not much time. Hi, Miles. I appreciate your dedication to interviewing, but I can tell you were clearly busy with something important. Mr. Sinclair put in an excellent word for you, as did Principal Evans. So, let's do this right, and meet this week on campus. In person. Got a few app requests popping up on BB's campus. Thought I'd call you directly. Oh man, I can't do this alone. Seems like you might need some spider help. Yeah, I had everything planned out. The clues, the screens, the art, the people, everything has to be perfect. Whoa, 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 okay, I got you. Can you explain a little slower? What happened? <sighs> okay, I want to ask someone to homecoming, but he's special. I couldn't just do flowers or chocolate. I got some screens and I want to light them up with the message, but the generator's busted. Guy who rented it out to me won't answer. What a scam. I think I can help. Thanks. I rented the generator from Reynolds and Company Rentals. I'll send you the address. On it. Generators are going for a lot these days. This baby's ours. You understand? That's no ordinary rental transaction. You look tired. Ain't nobody stepping to me. Mess around, find out. That takes care of these guys. I should check on the salesperson. Thanks, Spider-Man. Glad to help. Your client asked me to look into a delivery delay. I guess we got our answer. Yeah, about that. I'd love to deliver this thing, but those idiots already did so much damage. If she's salvageable, it'll take weeks of repairs. Mind delivering the bad news for me? Can do. Better call Vijay and give him the bad news. Tell me some good news. Well, it's news. Generator's busted. Wait! Okay, I'm not out of ideas yet. Just come back. I've got something else in mind. <laughs> Since the generator's no good, does BV have any backup ones? I know they keep generators on the roof, but they're all overpowered for my setup. We blow a fuse. Unless we find something underpowered. I should be able to pick up that low voltage frequency. And your electrical powers would fill in the rest. Theoretically. Worth a shot. Or a shock. I've got a friend who would love that joke. Really? 
found a generator, but it's deactivated. See? That should work great. Mind giving it your special... spark? Got the voltage we need. Now we just gotta route it to the ground floor. Yes! I knew you'd figure it out. Maybe I could connect these power nodes. Power seems to be traveling through an old circuit. I should go into electrical engineering. <laughs> Thank you, a million. Oh, maybe you should call yourself the Great Electric Spider. Thanks. I like Spider-Man. Oh! Just got a text. He's on his way. Uh, don't go just yet. I could still use your help. Just hide. DJ's texting me. What? A whiteboard? Oh, Vijay, what are you up to? Wait a sec. That's the equation he helped me with on our first date. Study session. Study date? Spider-Man, that's the first clue. Mind flipping it? Okay, looks like I'm going this way. <laughs> okay, what is this? Aw, that's the movie we saw when we had our first kiss. Look, braces, lip balm, and all. <sighs> but still, best kiss ever. Spider Man, poster is stuck. Can you give it a tug? <laughs> oh! <laughs> Vijay must be in the quad. Big reveal? Find a seat and grab some popcorn. Vijay? This whole thing has you written all over it. I've always known you're a special guy. And I'm lucky you're my special guy. I love you, Lucas. Will you... Will you... Ah, uh, home? Ah, uh, not exactly. Oh no, gotta be something I can do to help here. Need to use my chain lightning. Yeah! Homecoming? Oh, Vijay, of course. Matching sequin blazers? Hell yeah. Phew, that was close. Spider-Man! Come down so I can thank you properly! Thank you for making this possible. Holy crap! You really got Spider-Man in on this? Best day ever! Anything for love, guys. Happy for you both. Enjoy homecoming.
Allow me to set the stage. A train line in Brooklyn. Presumably, precious containers carrying commodities yeah, that we so rely on. Spider-Man and that new vigilante. Oh, you are mine! Get me out of here! Help! I'm working on it. Move fast, Spider-Man, or you will never escape. Hey, let him hit me. Try to relax. Betsy... Called again? Let's see what she had to say. Hello, Spider-Man. Um, I just wanted to let you know that Quentin has agreed to enter some court monitored counsel to help him with his post-prison transition. Finally. Cole, please be respectful. He's been through a lot. Sorry. I'm just... I'm just glad he's getting help. No. Anyway, Quentin asked me to pass this along. He thinks he's close to figuring out what's going on. So... Just keep up the good work, Spider-Man. Good on Beck for going into counseling. We all need help sometimes. Where is your courage? You are mine now! Get me out of here! That's the, That's plan. the plan. Be sure to look both ways before crossing, Spider-Man. Fake Mysterio's getting on my nerves! I wonder if this is how Beck acted back in the day. Skepticism will save you. Okay, mystery person. I'll keep that in mind. Why did the spider cross the road? 
Take however much time you need. You're safe. been through a lot. Another call from Betsy. Spider-Man? Cole and I are a bit concerned. He said he was gonna kill us! Please, Cole, don't get your hand. Spider-Man, we found out Quentin lied to us. Instead of going to counseling, he went somewhere else. When we confronted him, he said he threatened things and then left. Hopefully he just needs to cool off, but you see him or hear from him. Can you let us know? Thank you. Uh, oh my god, thank you! Please, don't leave me! Another day in the park? Why not? Hope that wasn't too rough of a trip. Take care. Bless you, Spider-Man! Hmm. 
Got a new voicemail. Spider-Man, we need to meet. Come to Coney Island. I have an urgent matter to discuss with you. Well, that doesn't sound... like a trap at all. Just hope he hasn't hurt Betsy and Cole. I couldn't back now too. Okay, where's Beck? Welcome, Spider-Man. If you're looking for Betsy and Cole, they are no longer with us. You killed them? Don't act surprised. You've known from the beginning who you're dealing with. What the...? Oh! 
I spent years behind bars, waiting for technology to catch up to my vision. And now, thanks to you, Whoa! my illusions are inescapable. You are mine for eternity. Uh-oh. Bad guys everywhere. If this is like the other illusions, the more baddies I take out, the closer I get to escaping. and I'll show you. Oh, you want to play fetch? Let's play. Why are you doing this, man? You could have used your powers to make the city a better place. This city never respected my talents. This isn't how you get respect. Fear breeds respect. One thing. Beck? Fighting. Keep doubting. It is the only way to defeat him. Wait. If you're here, Mysterio's out there. How is that happening? Oh! <laughs> Enough of this! I'll end you myself! You actually think you can defeat me? This is insulting! Everything that has happened is because I wanted it to happen! Now you're just making excuses!
time to get out of here. The sin is down. Get it back. I'm trying. <sighs> It was Quentin. He made us do this. Where is he? Help. In here. Somebody. Somebody help. I knew you'd find me. I still have a lot of questions. This... Should clear things up. So can I tell everyone Mysterio's a good guy now? <laughs> Mysterio will always be a villain. Just as Spider-Man will always be a hero. It's when you start looking at the people behind the masks that things get messy. Step in, dog poop, and it's all ruined.